Hello everybody, welcome to Mike's Mike. My name is Mike. Today is a special occasion. Also, this... I'm not going to explain it. As you can see in the title, today I'm going to try and cook ratatouille using the movie as my only reference. Now, what does that mean? Why are you doing this? Well, I'm a clown. If you want to know the extent of my clownery, it's currently 11.30 and I just, I just want to sleep. But no, Ratatouille calls, and when Ratatouille calls, I have to answer. Now, by some absolute anomaly in the simulation, I have reached 100,000 subscribers, which I, like, that is so insane. That is just... And before I start cooking and getting extremely frustrated and angry, I just wanted to say that I'm very, very thankful for everyone who subscribed to my YouTube channel. I can't believe that this happened. I can't believe you've done this. To prepare for this video, what have I done? I watched the scene multiple times and I paused it and collected a bunch of frames. I don't know who this man is. That kind of hinted at what the ingredients are. Now I'm not going to show the complete clip in this because Disney is just a whole other level of copyright like screaming. I don't have any other references. That's another point I wanted to make. <coughs> I know there are resources out there, but what kind of fun would that be? Cooking with the recipe? <laughs> That's for amateurs, love. So, this is my dish. Big boobs. Next, I'm going to show you the ingredients. Passata. Parsley. Zucchini. Eggplant. Eggplant. Garlic and some tomatoes. I also have some yellow squash, but these are like annoying. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to slice these up finely. When I get halfway through, I'm going to start cooking the passata. Actually, no, that's wrong. I'm going to start cooking the passata now. And then I'm going to put some garlic in there, a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper. Keep it to yourself, you bubblegum dum dum looking at bitch. Anyway, what does Remy do? Alright, so let's put that on low heat. Hello? Hello? Oh fuck, I don't care, I don't care, I really don't give a fuck. Um, I need to chop the garlic but I don't want to use the main chopping board, hence I have this little bitch ass chopping board. Chef Michael, care to explain why you're making this dish? I don't want to hear any excuses in the kitchen! Oh, so you want to bubble bubble to in trouble, huh? I diced the garlic, I'm going to put half into this, and then the other half is going to be... You'll see when I get there. Stop trying to get ahead. Bitch, shut up. Why did I not put any oil in this? Fucking idiot. YOLO. Look at the material. You should be going home You can anyway. be the judge of it. I can't believe I invented cooking. I'm out of here. If I heat the knife, will it cut faster? Why does the candy feel like that? I kind of hate that. I can cut finer than that. Flop. Hello, Bon Appetit Test Kitchen. This is my official audition to get into the test kitchen. I'm fucking going out. I've had enough of playing games. Fucking hell. I really said knife skills and then I backed it up. She just doesn't have the vernacular that she thinks she possesses. Wow, this eggplant really said seeds. The squash is like annoying. Like, why are you four dollars? <laughs> I'm cooking ratatouille. Well, how would you do it? It smells bloody beautiful, love. So I'm just gonna let that sit for a second. Who said that? Who said that? Who am I saying that? I do feel honestly ill. Why? Now I need to lay the pieces on top of this. Now in ratatouille, they kind of went a bum, 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 and they did like a circle and then filled the inside. Let me just show you what that shit looks like. Just a fucking flop in the pan. So. New plan. Just do it and then deal with it. Oh my gosh, Sweetheart. Angie, can't you just be real for five seconds? Oh, First of all, you've been running around real? like you did 80 lines of coke. Why do I feel like I'm having a heart attack? That seems mildly concerning. I just realized that I've had Fruit Loops there the entire time. Fruit Loops spawn. Oh, this should be here. Shut up. That looks kind of cute. I'm a chef, bitch. This next bit. There's a little bit of arts and crafts, and as you all know, I love arts and crafts. In the movie, Colette 
like puts some baking paper on there in the shape of the container and just kind of sits on top. Did I just freehand cut a perfect circle? Okay. I look shit. Um. Goodbye. Good luck. Have fun in there. I put the oven at 180 fan force because that just seems to be like the temperature that everything cooks at. Like if you're ever in doubt, 180 degrees fan force. That seems to be the way forward. That's degrees, not Fahrenheit because I'm not a dumb bitch that uses Fahrenheit. Who knows what time I'll go to sleep. Will I sleep? That's a secret I'll never tell. You know you love me. XOXO. Sleep demon. Fucking. Give me five. It's a vibe. In the hood like drive by. So Miss Thing was in the oven for 45 minutes-ish, I would say. Possibly overcooked, but I'd prefer to be overcooked than undercooked. Period. So now I'm going to cook the sauce. It looks buttery. There's got to be butter in there. So I'm gonna use some of the fancy butter that I stole from the buffet. I'm gonna put a little bit of garlic in there and then I'm gonna put a little bit of parsley on the end and then like a little bit of the sauce as well. Just to like Western Star butter, my favorite kind of butter. And there's a buffet that I go to that has a lot of this. And now I have a lot of it. I'm just absolutely doing fucking whatever here. Previously on Previously on Pretty, 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 Pretty Little Liars. Get off my finger. Why don't you think of putting heated rollers in here? Then I'm gonna grab some of this and just like eh, in there. That looks exactly like Remy's one. Bitch. Wait a second. That tastes fucking amazing. And keep in mind, small plate because it's 1 a.m. So I'm not gonna be eating a whole fucking thing of ratatouille. So it's like that. And then there's like another piece on top. And then bitch, we need some Parsley. I can't believe this. Hello studio audience. I thought I'd give you another close up look on the ratatouille. And now we taste. So I remember Ego going like this and getting some and being like, I mean, it's all there. And this sauce, bitch. That was so good. What the shit? Ratatouille, it's a peasant's dish. Are you sure you want to cook this for ego? Well, I think that was a success. I feel like every time I do a cooking video or a making something video, I think it's going to be shit. And then it's slightly better than shit. And I'm like, oh my God, that was so good. But that was really good. So that brings me to the end of this video. Bon Appetit Test Kitchen. If you watched this, let's talk. If you liked this video, feel free to leave a like. If you've got something to say, leave a comment. If you're not subscribed already, hit that subscribe button. Thank you so much for 100,000 subscribers. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you have a good couple of days and I'll talk to you all soon. Peace out. Welcome to the end screen. Here you will find another video for you to watch and a link to easily subscribe to my channel. So make sure you subscribe to my channel.